Hi everybody, welcome to Big Oki Golf. Been a while since we said that, but what a great way to start the year. Big news is coming now. Honestly, well, I say now, let me digress. Let's go back to the past slightly, although my wife has just said don't dwell on it. I know, but I think it's important for you to know things that happen in my life and um, me to be honest about things. Last year, I really wanted the channel to expand. I wanted it to grow. I wanted it to go in a direction that I hoped would make it successful in my eyes. It didn't happen. Lots of things went wrong uh, in the background. Lots of people who I wanted to be part of the channel were unable for various reasons to not be on the channel as much as they wanted. Um, it just didn't go in the direction I want. I felt uh, I let down a few people as well. And, and mentally I was struggling for about the last six months of the year. To the point after the Christmas special, I was literally burned out completely. Um, needed a rest. So I kind of took myself off the WhatsApp groups with, with all the lads and I, I kind of pulled my way, my way back from everything. Um, took a break from golf, I suppose you could say. Golf on, um, well, everything. Golf on YouTube, golf playing. Apart from popping to see Dan Hendrickson, really didn't do an awful lot. Um, concentrated on the food channel that my wife and I have got because I just needed a break for something else. If you're not a member of this, if you're not subscribed to the food channel, Big Oggy World, please do so because it's vitally important for that channel to grow and become monetized so they can help finance this channel because this one costs a lot more money to run with the traveling and expenses. So if you've not subscribed and doing the plug now, please subscribe to Big Oggy World and um, it's just a lot of fun. We're doing recipes and cocktails and we're gonna do a bit of traveling and a bit of fun and stuff as well. And we've also got a Facebook group called Big Ollie World, which incorporates the food, my art and the golf, okay? So go and find that as well. But please subscribe to that on YouTube. Now, the, the year, 2023, here it is. Taking me a while, a bit of a slow start for me on the channel, but in the background, there's been lots of things going on. There's still so much more to go on. Um, and it's all working out very well so far. Now, big news. The first big news we're gonna discuss very quickly is the fact that there is going to be a big Oggy Charity Golf Day this year. Woohoo! I know. Took a year off from it last year because I think I was probably struggling a little bit on the end of the year before, um, and I wanted a break. I wanted a break from not only organizing a, a, what has become a really big event, um, but also wanted to give the companies and stuff that have been really supportive over the years a break from me trying to cash stuff off them and trying to get things for charities and for the golf day itself. So we needed a break from it. We are changing location because I think two years in one place is enough. Uh, all I can give you right now is it's the Tuesday after the bank holiday Monday in August, the end of August. I think it's the 28th, but if I'm wrong, forgive me but it's the Tuesday after the bank holiday, Monday, which that's the date we always pick, uh, late August, okay? So kind of pencil that in. Can't give you any more details than that at the moment. Kelly, my wife and I, we are going to the course on Friday this week, and we're gonna sort out and iron out all the details that we wanna do, but it's gonna be a lot of fun. It's gonna be so much more than just a golf day as it always is on Big Eye Golf, um, and we hope that you're gonna be attending. Once I've got it all sorted, I've got a price worked out and everything, I will do a video and we'll put tickets on sale, etc. And this is just a kind of warning, let you know it is happening this year. There might be some other events happening, but we couldn't, we had to delay those for various issues, including my health. So what else, what else should we do? Well, I suppose the biggest news, but we really ought to do the biggest news next. Yeah, let's do the biggest news next. The biggest news is if you're watching social media, I have some new babies, new toys coming. Um, I say coming because this is very heavy, but it's not all of it. What am I gonna say? Well, I have been, well, given a fantastic opportunity, actually. Um, I am going to be an ambassador for Orca Golf. If you know Alex from Orca Golf and you know Orca Golf, you know how good these people are. Um, I went to Orca HQ some months ago now with Neil because Neil's always wanted Orca clubs 
and he bought a set of clubs. And I, when I was there, I was filming, I was talking to Alex, the, uh, the owner, um, the big cheese, and um, we just got on really well, just got on really well. Been talking backwards and forwards, have the kind of same mentality, had some idea for some fun things to do on videos, uh, which will all come to fruition in the big, in the big scheme of things. Oh look, it's got my name on it, big Oggy on there. Can't spell Oggy, it's double G by the way, Alex. Um, and recently, or just before Christmas, we got really talking about whether I could do some stuff for them. And uh, a couple of weeks ago, I went to be fitted for, these are irons and wedges in here. Um, but I'm going to be completely fitted out for a full set of everything Orca. Thank you very much, Alex, for um, wanting me to do this and for just wanting me to be part of your family now, part of the Orcaites family, I guess you would call us. Um, how much more detail do you need than that? Uh, it's all very open right now. Um, Alex has got a lot of issues to be dealing with um, with his own family at the moment, um, so uh, golf is not the precedence right now. But I'll be going back up in a couple of weeks time or a few weeks time and be doing a fitting for Woods and Driver and um, then we will discuss different things that I can do for Orca and Orca could do for us. Hopefully he might open a few doors for us, we might open a few doors for him. That's what a business partnership is all about. But I am now an ambassador for Orca Golf. Can't wait, very exciting. I would do an unboxing now but on Today is Sunday. On Tuesday, I'm going to be putting the iron fitting out. The, the high handicapper, me, uh, iron fitting, done at Orca HQ, and I don't want to kind of say what happened, so I want you to watch that first, okay? Then we'll do a bit of an unboxing for this, but at the end of that video, they do say what I get, because it was kind of a, a blind fitting where I had no idea which clubs I was going to get, which shafts I was going to get, and we just went through the process, okay? Um, Alex isn't going to be doing my fitting, because he was elsewhere. Um, it's actually John who's the head fitter and it's brilliant so it's a different dynamic to watching Neil who's a really good player being fitted uh, by Alex different jokes etc um, worth watching so come and watch my first video for Orca Golf and see what my new clubs are going to be I will do a little un unboxing very quickly um, in a week or so time and you'll start seeing them on the channel so with that in mind, whilst I was there, I was getting talking to Alex about some of the things that I hadn't done over the years that I wanted to do and we didn't quite finish, didn't quite complete. One of those was the, uh, the big Oggy revamp uh, in the fact that I wanted to kind of get down to 19. His suggestion was that he thought I could get down to 16. Now I'm 24 handicapper now, and what, say five or six months ago, I was doing really well. Things were starting to happen very well. Then I got the injuries, then things went a bit wrong, and then mentally I've got, I lost it a bit. So I'm going to do a new series, just like Neil with his 4x40, which hopefully he's gonna carry on. Um, I'm gonna do me trying to get down to 16. I'm gonna go title for that series yet, but that's what it's gonna be. Me trying to get down to 16 handicap, which I think is a pretty fair handicap for most people of a kind of an average uh, on men's handicap system now. So, that's the plan. There'll be lots of things. I'll be working with Dan, continuing with Dan Hendrickson with lessons, um, trying to get a bit fitter. It just goes up and down on my mental health, honestly. I eat when I'm sad. I eat when I'm happy. I eat when I'm stressed. I eat when I relax. It's got to change, but you know, we'll work on that. There'll be some fitness stuff. You'll be seeing my lessons. You'll be seeing my progress on, the ch on various courses. And um, yeah, follow my progress, which is kind of what we used to do in the old days. Uh, remember the ones when I had to sit in the car and just tell you on a kind of Wednesday, I'm off to play on the Wednesday comp and I'm hoping I'm going to do well and the weather is good and I come back and I've got 22 points and it all went wrong. We're going to go back to those kind of more personal videos with you. You know, Big Eye Golf is not about me and a gang of lads. It's about me and my journey, whoever I meet. So sometimes it'll be the lads, sometimes it'll be you. It could very well be you. And I promised a whole bunch of people last year I'll be working with them said mentally things didn't go right so I'm going to fix all that this year and I will be doing that. Um, what else? Well again a few people we need to be in touch with and have got in touch with me. This is very special. I love this. I'm going to do a video about this hopefully going to go meet the people who designed this but this is kind of going to be incorporating with the 16. This 
is from Cornutopia. Uh, husband and wife business. Let's see that. Right way up. Yes, it is. This is Cornutopia. Uh, they design maps, fantastically illustrated maps. Started off with one for surfing, I believe. And they've done a few of these now. This is the golf one. This is a, a three. They've got an A2 version, which I'm going to buy, um, put on the wall. And my plan this year is to play every course on this map. It's going to be hard because according to this map, there is 37 of them. And some of these courses, let's be honest, have always said they don't want us. Um, I'm not saying I'm going to do a course vlog on every one, but we're going to do as many as, we, as many as possible. And if they don't want a course vlog done, I'm just going to pay and go and play there. Take a little camera, we'll do a, just a fun video whilst we're out on the course, just to explain the course, just to say we've done it. I'm going to put this on the wall, or bigger version of this on the wall, stick some flags on it. Either be me, me and Neil, some other lads, there'll be some new ones. Darren Sturman's back as well on the, on the channel this year, so um, hopefully we'll get him involved on some of these as well. I've got some new faces that'd be good, and some of you as well. Yeah, be kind of cool. So we're going to put the link to their website because they've got some really good illustrations. They even do jigsaws as well. And I said, hopefully I'm going to do a video with these people very soon. Fantastic. Based in Truro, I believe. So again, very Cornish. So we're going to try and do all the Cornish golf courses. Now I know there's at least two tiny ones that are relatively new that aren't on here because of the way in nature of when things are designed. So we may have to add those on as well. But again, I got to collaborate with them and sort that out. But so we're going to do the, the journey to 16, race to 16, 16 something. Um, we're going to do play all the Cornwall golf courses, the Cornutopia golf courses. OK, um, but take a look at these designs because this is worth it. I think this is about £35 done on beautiful paper, proper, proper museum archive paper from what I can see. Well worth getting and framing and you do a bigger version as well. OK. But highly recommended. Love art. You know I love art. I'm an artist, so I'm going to love this too. So we're going to try and do that as well. Even got the silly R's on here. Might be one of my closest golf courses, but actually it's a bit of a way to get to. So it's going to be fun. going to be fun. Want to kind of join me on a few of these? See what we can do. So I'm going to put that away very quickly. Let's think if there's anything else to say. I think for now, that's probably enough. Um, we'll leave it at that but once again thank you very much to all those people that have been very patient with me over last year and I'm really sorry I didn't get in touch with you all thank you very much to Cornutopia for um, sending me this map and I'm going to try and do some stuff with them and thank you thank you thank you to Orca Golf it's taken me what five years to start being noticed by some some of the manufacturers out there and Orca you were the first person, first people to be brave enough to think outside the box in my world and find a 57 year old eye handicapper and go, we think you'd be worth getting out there and showing people real life golf with real life people and showing the advocate, advocacy of and the importance of golf fitting and the fact that it doesn't matter what experience level you are, you can still be helped by getting fitted. So. There are other things to say. I can't remember off the top of my head right now. I said mentally I'm still not exactly 100%. But there'll be lots of more regular videos from now on. Lots more personal videos like this. We're just chatting together. Definitely going to do live. We're going to do some live stuff on Big Eye World with my wife. And that might give me the confidence to start doing live here as well. I just need to get a bit mentally stronger. But we are there. We are nearly there now. Okay. Um, the golf day we will be organising this week. Oh, there's some also some giveaways. Milesy. Uh, we did the rangefinder videos for them, they loved them, and they've sent me um, some details for a couple of rangefinders we're going to give away. We're going to give away one on here on the channel, one on Instagram, I believe. Um, we'll do a video about that later on this week. So videos are starting to come out pretty regularly from now on. Thank you very much for your patience. Please subscribe, please hit the notification bell, do all these things. Come and join me on Big Eye Golf, my wife and I on Big Eye World. Just be a bit patient and then we'll hit the ground running. Bye everybody, speak soon. Love you all.